the inside here into turn seven as we look at Robert Van Gisbergen back in the pits. Yeah, there's one there. Oh, yeah. looking at Van Gisbergen up the inside. Oh, and, and they've gone around both of them. He took the opportunity and the first two have taken each other out. That's going to put Daniel Gaunt into the lead. Oh, they're struggling to recover. The whole field's gone by. Uh, SVG still in the dust behind us there and uh, Ann Pedersen's now back on circuit. But the big benefactor of this, Daniel Gaunt, well, and Greg Murphy, I mean, Pedersen was going to gain some points. Right, here's the run through to turn number eight of seven. Van Gisbergen sets it up, slips up the inside. Yeah, look, he's just not quite far enough up there and just a little kiss, but uh, it's affected them, unfortunately. Here we go from the onboard of Shane's. Was he far up enough alongside? Oh, look, it's a tough call. You know, Shane was able to get turned in a lot better than what Ant was, but, boy, that's a hard place to get a pass. Here's another angle looking from uh, across the other side of the track. Yep, synchronised spinning, and there they go. Exit stage right. First and second are gone. And